In this video, I'm going to show you how to get the perfect Panther belt in Red Dead Redemption 2. What's going on YouTube? I'm your host Aussie Gamer and welcome to another video. If this is your first time here and you want to get better at Red Dead Redemption, start now by subscribing so you don't miss anything. And now, without further ado, let's go and hunt ourselves some Panthers. Easy now. The Panther Pelt is needed for crafting the kit satchel, and the best location to find it would be right across this location in Rhodes, which is in the southernmost portion of the map. And as you can see here, there's already an image of this wildcat in this location, which indicates that this is a Panther spawning spot. The weapon that I like to use for most of my hunts is the Springfield Rifle. Which is mainly because it's a one shot, one kill gun, and it has a pretty good fire rate as compared to the other weapons. Now, panthers are nocturnal creatures, which means that they are most likely to be found at night. However, since I'm already here, I thought, you know, why not just go and do a general scoping of this area? Hmm. This house looks like a pretty good spot for camping. Yep, no panther here at this time. It's quite rare to spend this much time in the jungle and still miss the panther. As panthers are one of those animals that would actually come looking for you instead of it being the other way around. So I'm gonna try again at night. A little longer than a few minutes later. Alright, so it's night now, and I think I can now go back in the woods to do the hunt. Can't seem to find it anywhere. Ah, it's the same house. I could try climbing on top of this and do some camping. The panther won't be able to reach me, which means that I can take my time to get a headshot. But on second thought, let's not do any camping today, as it will just make things boring. Ah, I've been looking for you man, where are you? Ah, there it is. I hope I don't get killed here. Ah, I don't think I got a headshot. Let's go and have a look. So the red ball on the minimap means that the panther is still alive but injured. Let's hope we did not damage the pelt too much. Wow, I can't believe it. Three stars. I think I might have shot it in the neck or something, otherwise I wasn't really expecting a perfect belt. Look at it, it's still moving, you can see it's heartbeat. Alright, I think I can now finally kill it and skin it to get what I came here for. And there you have it, a perfect panther pelt. This is the hardest one to get in perfect state out of all the other animals. So if anyone wants to know, this is the exact spot on the map where I found this panther. What's your favorite weapon when you hunt for large animals? Let me know in the comment section below. Also comment if you would like me to make a video about something else related to Red Dead Redemption. And if you want to find more of me, please hit like and subscribe to my channel. If you are interested in hunting cougars, watch my video in the link on the right, in which I give great tips on how to get the perfect cougar belt. Thanks a lot guys, and I'll see you next time.